In this video I'm going to look specifically at the wavetable based wave shaping in the WMD Geiger counter. This red cable is a triangle wave from the Livewire AFG. It's going into a Maleco VC8 and I'm going to plug in this yellow cable into the VCA's CV input which is a sine wave LFO from the Bubble Sound ULFO. The reason for this is to provide some volume changes to show how the Geiger counter reacts to dynamics rather than just processing a static input. The black cable is currently going into an attenuator before going to my sound card, taking that cable out of the VCA and into the Geiger counter's output, so we're recording straight from the Geiger counter, slight bit of attenuation then into the sound card, and then taking this yellow cable I'm going into the direct input on the Geiger counter, avoiding the preamp gain stage and tonal shaping as I just want to look at the wavetables in the module. So I'll just scan through each wavetable and sort of demo through that. Wow. 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 Wow.
Thanks for watching the video, I hope you've liked it. The sheer amount of wave tables in the Geiger counter can be a bit overwhelming, but there's plenty in there from subtle and warm right through to a chaos and noise, even on such a simple input. It also has a preamp with plenty of gain and drive, a tone control circuit, and bit crushing and sample rate reduction as well, which I'll look at in some upcoming videos in the future. As always, feel free to comment, subscribe to this YouTube channel uh, for more videos coming soon. And if you want to chat about anything, you can always tweet at DivKid or message me here.